Well, hi, it's Christy Friesen, and I am delighted to be here with you because I have something I want to tell you about. Yeah, it's dyes. Everybody needs dyes. What am I talking about specifically? I am talking about Swelligant Dye Oxides. This is a fabulous little product, and there are 13 of them, so you can have all kinds of groovy colors. What does it do? It works with the other things in the Swelligant line. Now, Swelligant, if you're unfamiliar with what I'm talking about, right here on Fire Mountain Gems, there are other videos about Swelligant metal coatings, Swelligant patinas, some basics on using it, some projects. There's a lot of things. So go take a look at those, familiarize yourself with what I'm talking about, and then come back because I want to tell you specifically about dyes. Okay, the dyes are a way to add color to your metal. And that may be something that's coated with metal. So the metal coatings allow something that's not metal to be coated with metal and therefore become metal. Then you've added patinas, you've added some oxidation. Well, what if you want some purple in there or some blue? Or that rust needs to be more red or orange. Got you covered. We got the Swelligan dyes. We can handle it. So what this does, there's a lot of things out there to color stuff with. You can put, oh, alcohol inks on top. You can, oh, rub, different rubs in. You can do all kinds of stuff, and they're all great, groovy. You should buy everything there is to color everything. But what this does that's different from the others is it soaks into your metal, whether it's metal coating or actual metal, and it colors your piece from the inside out. So it actually soaks in, creating a very organic look, not a surface color, not something glaring or odd, but something that really looks like that metal just went and became purple, which is what you want, right? And you can layer the intensity. So if you wanted a light purple, you just put one coating on, but you wanted more intense, well, you put more. You want a little blue in there, you do. So you get to mix and match and play with them and get the intensity that you like. It's really fun. Well, let me show you a couple of examples here of what I'm talking about. This is a little owl that I made out of polymer clay, which, hint, by the way, right here on Fire Mountain, you can see how to make that owl yourself and get some very practical steps on how to turn it into a swelligented masterpiece. But if you look at it, you see how it's silver and it's got just a little bit of blue here and there. And there's some yellow around the eyes and yellow in the beak. That is dyes, baby. That is letting those metal colors be added on top of what you've already created. Something like this is a little bit more subtle. The dyes are mixed in with the patinas and it creates a different hue to the natural oxidation process. Uh, same thing with this one. This has got blue worked in. You see how organic that looks? It has a very artifacty, um, very artsy look to it. So it's a way of adding some beautiful colors in a very natural way. But it's not just onto your metal coated items. If you work with metal or you've got some uncoated metal beads or you're, you're hammering away at your copper and you're making a cuff, you want some color in that too. That's what the dye oxides do. They are a way to permanently color metal. One of the best ways to permanently color metal. And the trick is that you mix these dye oxide colors half and half with swelling it sealant. Sealant is also is part of the Swelligant product line. It's not a problem at all to add easily to any of the metals that you want. And then you get something like this where you start it off with maybe just a, a copper bead and you put it in a little uh, container of some of the dye. This one was purple. And you just let that color soak in. And then now you have something that has a very earthy purple look. It's not like an intense purple. It's just something nice and earthy and relaxing. Here's another good little example. This is another product here at Fire Mountain, and it's a very nice gunmetal, lovely little floral charm. And then see how I've added a bit of green, a bit of blue, and because there is already sealer mixed in with that patina, sorry, with that dye, when I painted it on, it's on there permanently now. It's not going to scratch off and chip off or fall off. It's on. So it's very, very fun and easy. So what it basically does is let you take your metal and add that bit of color to get artistic with it. Well, thank you so much for being here with me. I had a lot of fun telling you some creative things you can do, from swelligant to polymer and everything in between. Guess where you can find all of the supplies, videos, instruction, and help you need to get your creativity flowing. FireMountainGems.com, that's the place. So come look around and see what we have to offer. There is a lot of goodies for you.